We're going to make use of that feature right here with this. So we're going to draw a line, but first we're going to rotate our compass. We're going to do an RQ, which allows me to turn the compass any direction we want. And whether it's the polar mode or the Cartesian mode, the rectangular mode, doesn't matter. So what you do is you, you do the RQ, you spin it, and you say, hey, I want to point it this direction. It, then I'm going to go this way. I'm going to hit the enter key. That keeps the line going in this direction. Now I'm going to use I for intersect snap. It's going to look wrong at first until you do the, the uh, tentative. We're going to do an I, and I want the line to go this way, but I'm going to come over here. It's like, well, the line disappeared. That's okay. We'll do our tentative. And now it's doing a intersection between this blue line at the bottom and the line that we're actually drawing, which is kind of cool that you can snap to the line you're actually drawing. And now I just do a data and reset, and you can see that this line does, in fact, align perfectly along this line here. All right, there's one kind of gotcha that I, I ran into when I was first learning RQ. Let me show that to you. So when you do RQ, if you are in a snap position, I'm not even tentative or anything, just I see the yellow X. If I'm in a snap position and I type RQ, then you do not have to do a data because it assumes that that's what you wanted, that you were in a snap location, so it automatically gave me that. Matter of fact, if I actually did the data here after doing the RQ, I would have a line. And that's what always confused me. Well, sometimes I have to click and sometimes I don't have to click. So the rule is this. If you are just out and about and you do RQ, then you do have the data on the point where you want it to turn the compass. If you do RQ after you move to the snap location, any snap location, doesn't matter which, but I can do it up to here. I do RQ, then there's no data point necessary. Okay, so RQ to here, go this way, hit the enter key, I for intersect, tentative, beta, and reset. And that will that line would extend right through this point. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.